G'day everyone, Billy here. Well, I'm back out one of the local rubbish dumps um, where I scored those beautiful cabinets from the other day. So it's over a week later, fellas, and I can't believe no one's picked up the other beautiful cabinet. So I've got three beautiful cabinets now. So just a good cabinet, cabinet for storing tools, you know, drill drills and gr angle grinders and all that kind of stuff. And this frame here, fellas, is another one What I'm going to pick up. I think this belongs possibly to those kitchen sinks, what I found the other day. Possibly those kitchen sinks will fit in those steel frames perfectly. Anyway guys, someone's over there. He's unloading a heap of stuff. So a big trailer load full of trash and treasure, hopefully fellas. So we'll go over there in a minute. And I'll do a separate video on that guys. So, pretty quiet today fellas, there's nothing really here, so I'm just going to have a look over here, see what's here, any copper and stuff like that, they've pulled down a shed or something. Nice old rainwater tank here guys, even like a small one like that, it's all dented as you can see, but if I, still just enough there. To make a beautiful little veggie garden out of that so i've got my angle grinder and uh cut it around that little end part but as always guys i didn't bring my angle grinder today i left it at home i knew i'd need it too but nothing really here today fellas what's this here old argus fridge guys so this could be some Bit of scrap here nice i'm not too sure magnesium or something these handles are made out of i'll grab those and also those there so we'll take those off, guys so i always grab the nice magnesium handles unsure i think i've just usually chucked them in with my cast aluminium scrap but anyway, we'll see. So what else to see you fellas? Paint. Empty. Empty. Oh, bucket. See, it's come in handy. So I might grab this bucket, possibly, guys. Just let that paint dry out. Hit it with a hammer and all the paint will flake out. I just... Buckets always come in handy, guys. Look at this beautiful galvanised tin right here, fellas. So you could make a beautiful shed out of that. Someone's pulled down a shed. I don't need it. Got no space for that kind of stuff, guys. Anyway, there's, like I say, I haven't been here for a week, fellas, since I found all those beautiful miners picks and other tools. So Saturday today, so usually I'll come here first thing in the morning as soon as they open at 11 o'clock. And uh, then I'll go and have some lunch and so forth come back about two or three o'clock and then head back home so like I did last week guys came here in the morning came back three o'clock and someone dropped off all those beautiful cabinets and the old miners picks and so, nice old cabinet there for us. Right, the fixable dent there nuts stuffed to see fellas but in motor possibly old pump that beautiful pump there fellas probably still works too probably fellas rich farmers will be throwing it out anyway more people coming in dropping stuff off so hopefully we'll find some good stuff today guys if i do i'll do another video so i might grab this pump for my farmer mate dale he might be able to fix it up there's no doubt he'd have parts for that so we'll pick that up guys and take it out to dale his son campbell does hydroponics he grows all his own beer hops and stuff like that he makes his own beer i've done videos on campbell before so I'll put a link below to Campbell's hydroponic setup and his beer hops and everything else. So anyhow fellas, uh, <laughs> me
Mitsubishi Pajero is still there. I got it wrong twice last week. I said it was a Toyota Pajero. And then I said it was something else. And so is that Ford Explorer still there. Um, someone's been there. Looks like they've taken a few parts off. And the Jaguar is still there. So anyhow guys, we'll go up here and if I find anything good, I'll do another video. Then we'll go down to the garden waste section and there's a few big red bins what usually have got good stuff in them. So, alright fellas, so stay tuned. We'll see you shortly probably. Thanks for watching fellas. And this old tank here, I'll put over in the grass and come in on Monday with my angle grinder and pick up. There's a few things there guys, if I ever find stuff I usually try and put it to one side. My trailer's out of action at the moment fellas, but right here's a beautiful roof rack, it's stuffed. And just a beautiful little fence thing, what I could use in my garden possibly, or like a, a wall or something like that. Anyway guys, just got to be very careful of snakes. A lot of snakes around this area. I've seen them all the time. So anyway, we'll rip off these. These at stainless steel possibly or possibly even the galvanized. So I'll go and grab my hammer fellas and snap off those handles. Turn it over and snip off the cop copper and so forth. And even these fellas, if you're really keen. Uh, a bit of stainless steel. screwdriver I will and grab those so just a bit of stainless steel possibly even brass fellas sometimes brass is a silver color all you got to do is scratch with a screwdriver and or your angle grinder and if there's a nice goldy color there then it's definitely brass and right here it's a nice old electrical cord I won't take that guys because that fabric there's we coated with asbestos 